given the opportunity. Corner coming for Howarth, headed out by Aqui. Run back down by Oliveira. Checked out. Mine. He goes the hands. Oh. Aaron, pass off the boot of Canardo Forbes. The Hounds midfielder, former Rochester Rhino star, now here in Pittsburgh. First two years played at uh, Red Bull Arena for Red Bull 2. And now D2 compliant, 5,000 seating capacity. They start attacking, and you're saying, someone's going to score here. Does Red Bull 2 get one against the counter and really put them to sleep? FC Cincinnati gives up the PK. It looks like that's what's going to happen. Out of the back from Kuzminski. Finds Rittmeyer. The pressure is on. Lofty ball to Okonkwo. And um, cross. Draw one of those Red Bull def two defenders out towards you, and you're probably going to find an uh, open teammate inside the box. Ball up the line here. The New York Red Bulls. A lot of names have passed through that flat back line, so they've given up some poor goals. But uh, thinking back at the last result against Bethlehem, being up 2 nothing and then giving away two goals in the last five minutes, just... Hounds are shocked by the number of chances they're getting. And well, you know... I, not quite as good on the finishing end here. Yeah, but, you know, their, their Lee, lines both... Like, the, their midfield line is, is not connected. He sold it. That's Dopka's call, at least. The man in yellow... The most unpopular man right now in the stadium, Parks. A nifty ball yeah, through Red the Bulls, Red Bulls were looking for offsides there. The one half is, is, is. And off a body, by the way. Still loose. And balling out of there, Ben Mines had his second great look. Yeah, you Roberts, I think, on that one. I think um, he got a piece. I yeah, believe he did. I believe he did. He got back, held his ground. On the turf. A little bit of backspin off the Kerr send. Kevin Kerr has it again. He's looking spry suddenly. He makes a run. So does Parks. But New York defends. Well, 20 minutes to go, I really feel isn't it. And to Lima. Patrick can regain possession. Atula Guerra looking for a Conquo up top. But right now it's Tanari with the through ball to Aguinaldo. Who joined us for the game against ATL UTD2. You'll know Mike Anhauser just celebrated his 25th anniversary at the club. We'll get back to that in just a second. It's Tanari. Jokers Minsk. Now there's a real big uh, uphill climb now for these young players of New York Red Bulls. And the battery with the spring in their step. You could see Guerra and Okonkwo in no room. Draw one of those Red Bull def two defenders out towards you, and you're probably going to find an uh, open teammate inside the box. Ball up the line here. The New York Red Bulls. Lima dropping back for. And um, now Moreno coming across the field doesn't have anybody work. It's an extremely young side, no question about it. For New York, here's Moreno creeping up. Oh, finally, there's some urgency going forward. This Red Bull team has playing the ball a little bit quicker, start seeing it to get it. A little bit wider and through by Tanari. This time it's Kelly to step in the path. Can Atula Guerra get his head on this one? Lima in the middle of the park. Tanari could be a chance. It's Kataro Higashi into the box, forced to clear from Endam. And Nunga is there with the second ball, and Tanari lays it off into the middle of the park. It's very, very difficult for this young team to get through. Big ball forward from Kuzminski, picked out the air by Aqui. Every time they break, you can see another goal coming. Well, Red Bulls, too, have scored 54 goals on the season so far. 50 of those goals have come from inside the box. With three points here. Akwe goes up and wings a strong header, and that will be it. It was that kind of power on that ball. No. Really did. 
And we saw a goal scored in a similar fashion in that fantastic Spain Portugal match yesterday oh, in the yeah. World Cup. Uh, the name of the, the Spanish player who scored. Howarth streaking down the right side. Trying to fake Endom, who's got pretty good position. Good enough to get his team a goal kick. Oh, oh it's, no, it's breathtaking no, it's so it's far. <laughs> it's good. Uh, it's a big uh, crowd, too, to have I taken mean, it. It, it. It could easily be 3 2 right now. Yeah. Uh, so there, and uh, it, it, we had talked earlier. That's Hugh Roberts with a, a rare run up the pitch. He's yeah. still Look going. at him drag it with him. Yeah, and he's going to take some people on. There. <laughs> Hugh good. Roberts, I don't mean to laugh, but that was a different look. He just ran out of stick play there. By Cordell Cato and Zaid going one on one. Zaid knocked down in the box. And that turned out to be a Smith. What's the best goal you ever scored? Is there like one that's the clear? Um, I think one that was, I, I feel like the, the biggest moment for me was uh, Open Cup run, trying to make some noise in the playoffs and in the regular season in USL action while preparing a club to move up. Bouncing ball here, and then it will be put into orbit by off checked out. Mines. Hounds will play with 10 for the time being as Red Bulls 2 sends it to left flank, but quickly cleaned up oh. by Dover up ahead and uh, nearly a mishandle there by Akwe. It's Red Bulls 2 to go again. Tanari in the middle of the park. Aguinaga putting in some work at the top. The battery finding their defensive shape. Tanari. Out wide. Zima to lay one off. We in. Is this in? It is. It's in. New York have tied it up. It's 4 4 with just a couple of minutes left to play here at MUSC Hell Stadium. And it's Barlow again with the goal. Another one, Derek, to come out of nowhere. Barlow diverts it. Yeah, and what a finish. It's a, it's a great header. It's an absolute great header, but I think Joe Kuzminski will be...